A talented footballer, father, and a family man. One who loved life according to his family. We try a party next week now. Just so sure for what? To celebrate life. This was who Shadon was. He celebrated life in all its glory, full of life, spontaneous, and happy. While he used his talents on the football field to earn a living, he never forgot the source of his talents. Shadon had his own personal relationship with God. He gave God all the praise for the gift he had given to him. He never forgot to thank God whatever big or small blessing that came his way. To his former school, Naparima College, he was a legend. He was like a hero at Naps. We worshipped him. When he walked around the school, it was as if, you know, we were watching a movie or something. When he played for Naparima, he gave us everything. He didn't leave anything. While the Trinidad and Tobago Football Association said they, along with footballers, can learn from his life. If it is one thing that we can learn from Shannon's life is humility. And for all of us who are charged with governing football, or even to represent the country as players, do what you have to do, but remain humble. Presiding pastor Gladstone Coffee called on those gathered to honor Shannon by finding a way to spread the importance of road safety. I want to challenge us, all of us here, and everywhere else that, that, that you're hearing my voice. What if we take personal responsibility? What if we say in memory of Shannon, we are all going to go on a campaign to improve road safety awareness. We are all going to challenge ourselves, our friends. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports.